Dear student, due to coronavirus, school started online classes for your study. So you can subscribe Prodan Flower Palia YouTube channel, like and press the bell icon. Hello, good morning, student. Today, in class nine chemistry, the chapter is. Is matter around us pure? So earlier I was given to you about matter and its constitute part. So there is two kind of matter. One is a pure substance, and another is impure substance. Pure substance, the constitute particles. only one kind whether it is the atom or molecules what impure substances like mixtures mixtures have variable constitute particles means various type of constitute particles so here about mixture it is a substance which consist of two or more elements or compounds not chemically together means in mixture the elements or the compound these are known as constituent of mixture they are not chemically combined together so all solutions are mixtures for example air it is a mixture and air i have nitrogen gas oxygen gas carbon dioxide gas argon so many gas are present but these gases are not chemically combined together another example gun powder gun powder its constituent potassium nitrate sulfur and charcoal means potassium nitrate sulfur and charcoal and charcoal it is a form of carbon so these are the constituent of gun powder so this gun powder is also a type of mixture several several example here brine it is a salt solution and this brine made up of sodium chloride and water air sugar solution brass copper and zinc chalk water mixture and blood so these are the example of mixtures now student some characteristic feature of mixtures are here so first one variable composition means to say mixture contains various constituents that is elements or compounds means uh, mixture have various kind of compounds or elements by which they are made up 
No second is physical chains. Mixtures, they are not physically chains. Mixtures are the result of physical chains means the formation of mixture this is a physical change not a chemical change here next is no specific properties so here mixtures have average properties means mixtures not having any specific type of properties because they contain uh, several type of compounds or elements next is homogeneity they cannot have A special homogeneous nature means uh, homogeneity, not a uh, same kind of particles or molecules. Next is separation. Mixtures can be separated. Easily by physical means. Means by physically, we can separate the constituent particle of mixture. Means they are separable. At last is energy changes during the formation of mixture. Change in Energy takes place. So these are the various characteristic feature of mixture about homogeneous mixtures. So here those mixtures in which the substances are completely mixed together and has no indistinguishable form another means to say those mixtures in which the substances are completely mixed together and are indistinguishable from one another are called homogeneous mixture. For example, sugar solution means the solution for by water and sugar. Second, alcohol and water means both are the miswill alcohol miswill in water and form a homogeneous mixture unpolluted air if air is unpolluted then it forms a type of homogeneous mixture next is salt solution solution of sodium chloride in water so here two things homogeneous mixture one has uniform composition throughout its mass second has no visible boundaries of separation so here these two 
characteristic feature of homogeneous mixture. Now next is heterogeneous mixture. So those mixtures in which the substances are not completely mixed together and are distinguishable from one another. Means homogeneous mixture, indistinguishable and heterogeneous distinguishable. Means we can separate from each other. So here does not have uniform composition through its mass and has visible Boundaries of separation. Example iron and sulfur. So we can identify easily. Second, suspension. Suspension, these are also heterogeneous mixture. So it is about homogeneous and it is about heterogeneous mixtures. Now, student, some more explanation about heterogeneous mixture. So here, sugar and sand. It is a kind of heterogeneous mixture. Because we can see a separation or a visible boundary between sugar particle and sand particle. So we can separate it. Now next is the suspensions of solid in liquids are also heterogeneous mixtures. So for example, a suspension of chalk in water. Suppose that we take a some piece of chalk and dissolve in a water. So it forms a heterogeneous mixture. Next is a mixture containing two or more immiscible liquids that is not, not mixed to each other also called heterogeneous mixture mixture of but not and next is all the suspensions and colloids are heterogeneous mixture so here milk Soap solution, star solution, butter, face cream, petroleum, milk of magnesia. So these are the example of heterogeneous mixture. So student, about mixtures. Divided into part homogeneous mixture and heterogeneous mixture and with examples. 
so student this is a for you thanks for the day do self study at home and stay home save lives thank you very much